If you're looking, we're going to switch gears now. If you're looking for a fun idea for the whole family, consider going to the Cougar Mountain Zoo in Issaquah. The zoo's director, Jared Munzer, joins us now. Good morning. And what animal? I'm not going to guess this time. So <laughs> what, just tell me what we're looking at now, <laughs> what we're going to be. So right now we're actually going to be letting our tigers out into the exhibit. So since it is going to be so hot today and tomorrow, there's a lot of different things that we do to help keep our animals cool. We have a lot of different enrichment what? activities. Okay. So this morning they're actually getting some ice blocks. Oh my goodness. So we put one down into the pool here to encourage them to go for a little swim. And so they go in <laughs> so after the ice, two right, Bengal Jared? Tigers. Yep, yep, here he goes. So this is Bagheera. He's a nine year old Bengal tiger. Wow. How much does he weigh? So, and Bengal tigers do love to swim. So they can range anywhere between four and 500 pounds. Wow. <gasps> Look, how cute. Let's see it, let's go in, go in. So really, how often do they swim? I didn't realize <laughs> it's something that they did often, Jared. Yep, so they will swim to stay cool. So sometimes if the water's a little chilly, they might not go in there right away. <laughs> so, but this is, uh, this is Vitae's, he's another Bengal tiger. So he's actually Bagheera's brother. They're from the same oh. litter. Oh, wow. And why is he, he's white and, and he's orange. Why is that? Yep, so it's just uh, a recessive gene that causes the white coloration. It's kind of, kind of the equivalent of hair color in people. Oh, cool. So one of the neat things at the zoo is we do different, we do different enrichment activities for all of our animals, whether it's, you know, the, the parrots and the macaws all the way up to the big tigers, um, different things to keep their minds stimulated, keep them active. And uh, one of the great ways to see all that is being a member here at the zoo because we do different things all the time. Uh, oh. We'll do different things around the holidays. We'll do things oh, just yay. for fun. Um, up oh, here he goes. Oh, uh, <laughs> cute! I love how so he's Jared, swatting it. So Jared, you were you were feeding the macaw. I don't feel like you're going to feed the the tigers by hand. But can you tell us what do they eat? How much do they eat a day? I'm just curious. So they eat quite a bit of meat, and while I'm not going to feed them by hand, we actually do offer a, a really cool opportunity for the guests to have a one-on-one -on -one inter interaction with the tigers. Uh, we offer a tiger, tiger feeding experience where the guests can actually feed the tigers through a very protective, safe manner. Um, you know, and that's a really cool way to really appreciate an animal like this because it's not very often you get to be just a pane of glass or four feet away from a big animal like wow. this. That is absolutely really gives you a true. great appreciation for them. Oh my goodness. Well, we How really adorable. appreciate you, Jared, for showing us this this morning. Wow. Um, this has been incredible. Oh, of course. Oh, uh, we can't wait. I'm coming down with yeah. my kids for sure. <laughs> um, so we will chat with you again coming up pretty soon. Oh, this is it. This is it. That's all. Oh, well, yeah. thank you. That was so fun. Oh, that was really fun. I'm glad fun. he got in the water. We got to see him get in the water. We did get to see him cool. get in the water. I thought, you know, it's still a little chilly this morning. He might not get did in. You see him but swatting at it. Really <laughs> so interesting. Cute.